Video cast number 28, other uses for a Dutch oven. The traditional use for a Dutch oven is over the fire with coals and sometimes suspended on a tripod cooking a stew. One of the reasons that a Dutch oven is so good is that it provides an even heat, transferring the heat to the entire surface. Once that surface is hot, it stays hot for a long time. The deep basin on Dutch ovens make them useful, not just for stews, but you can take them and put them on a stove top, propane grill as well. Once the oven is nice and hot, you can easily use it as a fryer with oil to pan fry meats. It's a nice sturdy surface that can contain the juices and splashes and make cleaning up easier. And because it retains heat well, you can just put the cover on the top, turn off the heat, and still have a hot meal 20 minutes later. Using this method, I made a simple burrito lunch using a Dutch oven on a stovetop, but you can do this with eggs in the morning as well. First, I put a pre-sliced chicken breast in a heated Dutch oven basin to cook the chicken. From there, I moved the chicken, covering it with aluminum foil to keep it warm. In its place, I put two cans of black beans and a jar of salsa, warming it up. When the bean mixture started to boil, I added a generous amount of cheddar cheese and removed the Dutch oven from the stove. Doing this allowed the cheese to melt to the top of the bean mixture while I prepared the tortillas. Then I took the cover of the Dutch oven and put it at the inside facing up and it's a heating surface. I added a little cooking spray and placed a tortilla on my new cooking surface and began layering some of the cheese, the cooked chicken, and the bean mixture. Folded it over and repeat. Because the Dutch oven is pre-seasoned, all I needed to do was scrape out the remainder and wipe with a damp towel to clean it up. This technique is best when you want a way to retain heat, which is why Dutch ovens are so good for stews and chilies, but not so useful for making pasta, as you need to boil the water to get to your end product, and once you're done, you don't need the heat. The lid cooking method is also great for pizzas and grilled cheese, where you're looking to melt. The lid can be used on the stove or placed directly in the coals with the handle side down. But this is what works for us. Take what you like, leave the rest, and as we say in Wood Badge, feedback is a gift. Leave yours below in the comments with the hope we can all learn together. I'm Scoutmaster Dave, and this was Other Uses for Dutch Oven.